I tried to mix a rap song in Pro Tools using one plugin. Ooh. Yeah, that sounds way better. In order to become the best, you have to work like the best. I have to challenge myself. So, I went to the drawing board, got some Swissers, and rolled up some of that stanky stuff. Hey, yo, yo, this is fire, bro, this is fire. Packed it up precisely, took a few hits. Wait, you smoke? Set up my studio, took out my phone, and wrote out some of the most dopest bars you ever heard in your life. And I recorded a hit song just for this video. What's poppin' gang? I wanted to emulate what it's like mixing from back then. You know, they didn't have any VSTs. They didn't have any plugins. They just had knobs and anything you did was pretty much permanent. This is my representation of what it was like to mix back then. Got a Drake though, up in the place you can't go. Got dirty pics on the camera. Got cover fiber on the pan. Won't give me none of the hand hand. So I have a session pulled up here, ready to go. The first plugin you see right here is auto-tune, but look, look. I gotta have some type of auto-tune, the type of song that we're doing. So this don't even count, you know what I'm saying? You can't count this, don't even, imagine this auto-tune is not even here, you feel me? So don't even look at this, so we just gonna skip that, okay? So we are gonna go ahead and go to an actual channel strip plugin that I feel like, you know, we can use with EQ, compression, leveling. Let's go with this one right here. I feel like uh, this one might be a good one to actually try out. First thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna just go ahead and start from top to bottom, you feel me? So let's start with the bottom end of my vocal. Lego, are you what the nigga to pay for? On the side, got a Drake go up in the place you can't go. Good. Look for some really bad EQs that need to get taken out. Let's cut around like 300 to 200 hertz, and around that tends to be like a lot muddy. And this is boosted up so we can find that frequency. Let's click right here so we can change it to like it's more like a bell because I want to dip out anything that's muddy. Long talks about dreams. Set it built like a Lego. Are you working on the set? Got a Drake go up in the place you can't go. Good. Okay, so around there it sounds really muddy. So we're gonna go ahead and turn that down right there. Long talks about dreams. Set it built like a Lego. Are you worth a nigga to pay for? It already Stop. starting to sound a little bit more clean. You can't go. Cut dirty pics on the camera. So let's go ahead and move up a little bit higher to the higher frequencies. Same process with this. Let's boost it and find any negative frequencies and then turn it down. Long talks about June. Set it built like a Lego. Are you worth a nigga to pay for? Yeah. On the set, got a Drake go up in the place you can't go. And next, we're gonna go ahead and go ahead and move on to the highs. On the set, got a Drake go up in the place you can't go. Got dirty pics on the camera. Got carbon fiber on the panel. Won't give me none of can't handle. Living like short and sample. So let's go ahead and jump into the compressor. So I'm moving the threshold down. As soon as it starts to get to the threshold, that's when it'll actually start compressing the vocal and moving it down. So my threshold here is at zero. Let's go ahead and move that down. Long talks about dreams. Set it built like a Lego. Are you worth a nigga to pay for? On the set, got a Drake go up in the place you can't go. As far as like a ratio, I want my ratio for my vocals to be like around three to one. But since we're doing like one compressor, I might do a lot more actually. So let's say 6.1. Long talks about dreams. Set it built like a Lego. Are you worth a nigga to pay for? On the set, got a Drake go up in the place you can't go. I want this to sound like it's closer in your face. You know what I'm saying? Let's go ahead and give it some gain. Long talks about dreams. Set it built like a Lego. Are you worth a nigga to pay for? Let me just keep playing with it a little bit more with the compressor side just to see if I can get a better sound. Okay, so I found this threshold button right here, and this right here actually brings up the low volumes and stuff like that to a line level where it's a little bit over the music and or however you want your vocals to be. So I wanted that to be apparent with my vocals. So I wanted my low parts of the vocal to at least be higher enough to the point where you can at least hear it a little bit more. So that's what I did with the stress hole. You gotta like turn it up a little bit. Long talks about dreams. Dreams. Set it like a Got to work on me, I'm ready. Yeah. Woke up this morning in the weapon. Yeah. Trapping it. Like when I see my P's and my B's and stuff like that, I want a little bit to just, just to pop through, you know what I'm saying, while that's playing. Kind of catch it a little bit to kind of control it. So, okay, let's do a slower attack. Long talks about dreams. Set it built like a Lego. Are you worth a nigga to pay for? Yeah. On the set, got a Drake go up in the place you can't go. Yeah. 
So let me go ahead and move that over to the ad libs. What I'm gonna do with the ad libs is turn some of the highs down. I don't want the highs of the ad libs fighting with my lead vocal. You know what I'm saying? So let's go ahead and turn that down. And that should pretty much be it. Let's go ahead and hear that. Let me go ahead and turn this gain down a little bit so it's still not like the exact same volume as my lead vocal. Long talks about dream, so it feel like a Lego. I just want the nigga to pay for on the side, got a Drake. And then also with the ad libs, let's go ahead and actually make the high pass filter a little bit more serious. Let's turn it up to like 200. Long talks about dream, so it feel like a Lego. I just want the nigga to pay for on the side, got a Drake. Go up in the place you can't go. Okay, so I feel like that sounds good. Maybe just a little bit more on the threshold. That's pretty much it. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know what other videos you want to see on this channel. Hopefully you guys stay safe. All right, peace.